a memorial to a 22-year-old man shot and killed Monday afternoon in Northeast Baltimore. Totally shocked that this, that this has actually happened. The victim, Tyrone Ray, grandson of Maryland State Delegate Talmadge Branch. The shooting happened in the 4200 block of Nicholas Avenue, not far from where Ray's grandparents live. This happened at 1230 in the afternoon, about this time of day. It absolutely makes no sense. All I heard was bang, 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 bang. A neighbor agreed to speak to us if we did not identify him. After you heard the barrage of, of, of fire, gunfire went on like that, man, it couldn't nobody survive that. Branch says just two weeks ago, Ray injured himself on a dirt bike, breaking his ankle. He had been using crutches since then. For the life of me, I don't understand why somebody could see a guy on crutches. Tyrone's about five foot five, all of 130, 35 pounds. I mean, he's not a threat to anybody. Police think this surveillance video captured images of two suspects walking toward the 4200 block of Nicholas Avenue. One dressed in all black, the other wearing a light colored hooded sweatshirt. Investigators believe Ray was targeted. The uh, suspects shot um, the person that they wanted to shoot, so to speak. Um, why did they shoot him? We don't know. That's something that we're still investigating. Once again, another family in mourning, another neighborhood touched by violence. I'm talking about nationwide. We just got to stop this man, man, what I like man, because the young souls are being just taken away. The number of deaths that we have in this city is unexcusable, and we have to do something about it. And Branch says that his family is torn apart. He says that many families are hurt by these killings. And he also says he will work with the Baltimore police and also the city to try to find solutions to stop the violence. Reporting live from downtown Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV 11 News.